y'all, it's Kate from the Literary Apothecary, and today we're going to do our weekly reading wrap-up for the week of January 16th to the 22nd. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm doing this a little bit early and also early in the morning, so bear with me, y'all. This is going to be a rough one. First, let's thank some new subscribers. We have Author Whispers ASMR. Welcome. Thank you for subscribing. It really means the world to me because without you, I'd just be sitting here talking to myself. So thank you, thank you, thank you for subscribing. You are the best. Now let's get on to uh, my reading that I finished this week so far. I finished, finally, Jonathan Strange and Mr. Norwell by Susanna Clark. Y'all, this book was so freaking good. So good. I was so enthralled. I'm actually reading rereading the end because I was kind of doing an immersion read, listening to the audiobook, and I kind of, it was late at night when I couldn't fall asleep. I kind of fell asleep at one point and missed a whole bunch. So I'm going back and rereading it, and y'all, it was so good. It's even better on the second read. I can't wait to reread this whole thing again sometime because this was so good. It was so exciting. Five out of five stars. I can't wait to do a review and talk about this. I also finished a whole bunch of short stories by Stephen King from Night Shift. Um, the Lawnmower Man, which was a very weird, weird short story. Um, Quitters Inc., which was felt like one of those classic Stephen King's where it's like real life, but not real life. Um, real life with a little bit of craziness put in there. And then I knew what you need, which was weird. Um, very weird. The ending kind of left me wanting something different. Um, so yeah, that is my reading that I finished this week. Now, let's talk about my current reads. Currently, I am still reading Green Rider, and I am nearing the end of this book. I'm enjoying this so much. I cannot wait to talk about this with Josephine. I'm enjoying it a lot. I hope to finish it maybe this weekend. I'm going over to my boyfriend's this weekend, which is why I'm filming early, but we'll see if I can get some reading in. I'm also currently reading The Ember Blade. I started this this week. Once I finished Jonathan Strange and Mr. Norwell, this is a classic fantasy travel adventure. I'm enjoying it. This was my patron pick of the month by Andrew, Andrew's Wizardly Reads, and yeah, I'm enjoying it. Still making my way through Anathem. Um, I'm enjoying this, and I'm told I'm getting to like the part where the plot really starts to take off, so I can't wait to see this. And still listening to Wizard's First Rule, which I'm really enjoying. Now, my next reads are going to be Star Sight by Brandon Sanderson, book two in the Skyward series, Ink and Bone by Rachel Kane, which is book one in the Great Library series, part of our library series discussion, uh, magical library series discussion with Sharon Dwyer. The Idiot by Fyodor Dostoevsky, and So the Song of Achilles by Madeline Miller. So that's my very quick reading wrap up for this week. Let me know what you all read this past week, what you're looking forward to reading next week. I can't wait to talk books with y'all. As always, my Patreon and my Discord information will be in the description below. No pressure to join either, but we have a fun about ton of fun. There's no pressure to join either, but we have a ton of fun at both. And my patrons only $1 a month, so if you want to support me financially, come join. Keep reading, and I love you all to the moon and back. Bye.